In this video, we will explain how to fix a USB flash drive or memory card that cannot be formatted when connected to your computer. Many Windows users, when they see this issue, think the USB drive is damaged. But today, we will learn how to solve this problem with simple steps. But first, I hope you give the video a like. And if this is your first time watching me, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification bell so you never miss any of our tutorials and reviews. And most importantly, please support us by giving the video a like. Let's get started. The first step is to make sure the USB drive is working and can be fixed. To confirm this, right click on the USB drive and choose properties. Then go to the hardware tab and check if it says device is working properly. If it says something else, the drive may be damaged. Once you confirm the USB is not physically damaged and is fixable, open the command prompt CMD as an administrator, type CMD in the search box, then right click and choose run as administrator. Now type the command disk part this command is used to manage connected disks. Then type list disk. Make sure there's a space between list and disk. Here, you'll see the list of disks. Identify your USB drive by size. For example, I have two flash drives. One is 3 gigabytes, and the other is 1.898 gigabytes. After you find the drive number, type select disk x, where x is your USB disk number, like this. Next, type the command clean. This will erase all data from the USB drive. The next step is to reformat the drive so it becomes visible again in Windows. Since we just wiped the drive, we need to initialize it. Open the run window by pressing Windows plus R and type disk mgmt.msc then press enter in the disk management window right click on the USB drive you just cleaned it will usually appear in black like this right click and choose new simple volume or create simple volume when the window appears click next then select the full size of the USB drive, meaning all available space. Click Next and choose a drive letter for your USB. Then click Next again. You can give your USB a name if you like. Then click Finish. Once this is done, the USB will appear on your computer again, just like this. And you'll be able to use it normally, whether to format it or store files on it. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a like. And if you're new here, subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification bell so you don't miss any of our upcoming tutorials and reviews.